Hello everybody, my name is Ifa Labi and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a very exciting and disconcerting video for me. Over the past week, I was asking people what was their weird food combos and I got a variety of answers. Seriously, you people, I don't know if you guys were pulling my legs or like you guys were very serious about these food combos. I chose five out of them to try. There's no way I could do a weird food combo without starting with my own weird food combo, right? And my weird food combo is french fries, potato chips, and ice cream. Why do I like this? I just, it's, you see, when the fry is very hot and the ice cream is very cold and the fry is salty and the ice cream is sweet, you know, that sweet, salty texture, I just, it just does something, okay? So you take the fry, dip it in the ice cream, and then... Mm. This is even better if like it's a milkshake. Also, I need to know which food place has the best fries in Accra. Because I'm always on the hands for like really nice, crunchy, salty, flavorful french fries. I might actually test all of them out. So just let me know in the comments. I'm done with this first combo. Second weird food combo is this thing called deep fried Oreo. So basically, it's a combination of an Oreo and pancakes. So basically, what you do is that you take the Oreo and then dip it in a pancake mix and then deep fry it. I have so many questions about this. Like why? That's my number one question. This is how it looks like and I'm going to try it. This is how the insides look like. You can see the Oreo and the pancake. This is not something you would eat all the time. I feel like on special occasions when you just want to be unhealthy, you would do this. But, I mean, it's a great weird food combo, but pff, don't do it. Like, if you can do pancakes, just do pancakes on its own. If you can eat Oreos, eat Oreos on its own. Don't do this. I mean, is it good to try? Of course it's good to try, but like... Has anybody tried deep fried Oreos? I want to know what you think about it. Like, is this something that you like all the time? Onto our third weird food combo. Now, this weird food combo I got a lot, which is spaghetti and milk. So this is my pen pasta, milk. I have so many. Like, who thought of this? Who who thought of this? Who woke up one day and was like, you know what, pasta is missing, milk. I just I just want to know who thought of this and then tried it and decided to give it to someone else and they're like bro you hacked the code are you supposed to add sugar to it or oh, like no sugar i feel like my stomach isn't going to be happy with me brown sugar they are being healthy i feel like crying honestly i really don't want to eat it okay here goes nothing So where do we go from here? What What is this dish? Is it breakfast? Is this lunch? Is it a snack? Is it dinner? It's such a weird combination in my mouth because I expect when I eat a pasta, I expect like something creamy or something savory. And this is like sweet. All those who eat this, do you eat it like in the morning? Do you wake up in the morning and go like today, I feel like eating pasta and milk? No, I'm not going to try it again. This. I so know for me I'm annoyed moving on to our last but one weird food combo is Cerelac and granite I got this food combo from Twitter the person said that they eat Cerelac with granite and my only question was is it like Gary Sokin's I'm going to try it so another bowl I got my Cerelac and for everybody that's going to come in my comments and be like oh you still eat Cerelac there's no age limit to Cerelac. Here's my relationship with Cerelac. I like it when Cerelac is very hot and very hard. Okay, but to eat this with granite feels like... <laughs> uh, okay, okay. Enough complaining. Let's do this. <sighs> granite. I don't, I, don't, I don't think I can do this. I don't like it. Once again, what leads to these weird food combos? What was the reason? reason? What was the reason? reason? I'm sorry, like this is terrible. But this leads me to my fifth weird food combo, which is this travesty 
with Gary. So now that I already have my Cerelac and Granite, I'm supposed to add the masterpiece that is Gary to it. My Gary. Okay. More milk. This tastes like something that was conceived in a boy's boarding school. Nobody can convince me otherwise that a boy didn't concoct this because this is a mess. This is an atrocity. I'm sorry, I can't take another bite. This is terrible. It's an assault on my taste buds. Like, it's just so many things at once. And I don't understand. Like, I don't understand what's happening in my mouth. Why? Why is this a thing? So, I'm done with this video testing out five weird food combinations and seeing which one is the best. Frankly, my one is the only one that's the best, which is the fries and ice cream. Maybe the deep fried Oreos, but that one is for like a special occasion. Apart from that, all of all the rest, no. Pasta and milk, no. Cerelac and granite, no. Cerelac, gary and granite, no. We have to draw the line somewhere. Thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure you leave your comments about your own personal favorite weird food combinations and then i'll do a part two maybe a part three of all these weird food combos i enjoyed making this video even though some of the things were very upsetting don't forget to comment like share subscribe to this channel okay my name is ifalabi i say my name too many times Mwah.